Hi, I'm Harry Burdett. I'm teaching blacksmithing classes at my shop in Broomfield at the Community Education Department at Arapahoe Community College. Today I'm going to do a demonstration of a simple S-hook. So the first thing I'm going to do is start off with a piece of 3 8 square steel and draw out a single axis taper on either end, something like a screwdriver point. Then I'm going to twist the middle and bring the whole shape into an S-hook. I'm going to use the cross peen side of the hammer in order to drastically and rapidly draw out the material. Now that's a bit rough looking, so I'm going to use the flat side of the hammer, the planishing side, to smooth out that crinkle cut french fry appearance. And that's ready to go back in the fire. So, second verse, same as the first. So now we have a piece of material that has a screwdriver like single axis taper on either end. Next thing to do is to take a heat in the center of the bar and twist it. So that's the start of one side. We'll brush off the fire scale. And we'll start the slower part of the curve over here. And there's one half. Now to go the other way. When you're scrolling, you never want to hit the steel in the same place too many times. You'll make a flat spot. So it's really just kind of a conversation with the material. Well, it's getting cold, so let's stick it back in the fire. We're getting there. I'd like to take one more heat just to clean everything up. All right. So there is a completed S hook. And brushing it like that really pulls out the highlights and kind of accentuates the natural, rugged character of the object. I'm Harry Burdett. Happy forging. <laughs>